there, welcome back to the channel once again. Uh, this week you find me in a location that myself and John visited about a month ago. It's called the Murder House. If you remember, there was an elderly gentleman that was attacked by a number of robbers and he was left naked and killed in the next room actually, in the living room, um, in the middle of the floor. Obviously myself and John had a fair bit of activity here last time we come. But as this is my last week on my own, as John returns tomorrow, um, I thought I'd come here, see if I can pick something up and see if I can sense something, because you tend to get a little bit more when you're on your own sometimes. So I hope you enjoy this evening's Explore. I'll speak to you shortly. All I ever wanted was you, but you left me alone inside these empty broken walls. And I can't see it clearly, but it's obvious I know. Oh, there we go. Okay. What I thought I'd do this evening was something a little bit different. I've put a number of cameras around the house. I've even put a spirit talker in the bedroom with a camera and an EF meter and a cat ball on the bed. I've got a camera at the bottom of the stairs. And I thought what we do this evening, we'll uh, put as many devices out as we can just to monitor the location. And I'll spend some time in the kitchen, do a bit of calling out. Um, I've just had come through in actual fact. Uh, power, oh, I don't know. P R A P R A, no, P A R A, B O L O, looks like I D A L, and a spiritual experience. Thank you, Spirit. I'm very open to any spiritual experience that I may have here. My name's Michael, by the way. I've introduced myself. I wonder, is the elderly gentleman that was viciously murdered here, is he in this location? I'm not going to give you his name. I want to see if he'll actually bring it forward to me. I have noticed walking around, there has been someone here since the last video, because every door was open. <laughs> Supernal. I'm not sure what supernal means. Yeah, so every door in the location was open except the front door, and this table was wedged right up against this sink unit. So certainly we've had some probably children in here. Someone. It's very surprising because it's quite out of the way, it's quite rural. And I've just heard walking.
Um, I've also put two cat balls on the top of the stairs, just on the edge of the staircase. So I'm hoping that a spirit will come forward. Can I ask please, there's two small flashy balls at the top of the stairs. If you're here spirit, could you maybe push one of them down the stairs? Or both of them would be great. I'd really appreciate anything you could do. So please come into this space, come into the environment and speak with me if you would. I've already given you my name, Michael. I'd really appreciate your name if you could. Maybe if you couldn't say it here to me on this device, there's another device upstairs in the master bedroom. Union? What do you mean by union spirit? Was there a union between two people? Please come forward and give me something this evening. Can you see the cat ball going off? I haven't moved, I'm sitting perfectly still, there's no vibrations. Thank you spirit, is that you? Could you maybe move this meter that's here to the left of the phone? For some reason there's a sharp knife here on the middle of the table. We'll move that out of the way. Spirit, I have multiple devices in this location. You can approach any of them and speak. Let me know that you're here, please. They are watching. Can I ask please who's watching me? You say they. I understood that the poor old chappy that died resides here. And you mentioned they. So how many spirits do we have here please? I thought I'd see a flash in this utility door then. A couple, thank you. So there's two spirits here. Would it be the husband and wife that reside here, please? Could you confirm by either moving a cat ball or the meter? Could you confirm, please? Moon? What do you mean by moon, please, spirit? Maybe it was your surname Moon? What relevance is it to you? This is something different tonight, obviously. I'm not moving around the location so much. I just really want to pick this spirit up and talk to him some way, somehow. A couple. We've had, we've had a couple. Clearly you've just said there's two of you here. So I will take that as the man that was murdered and maybe his partner. Could you confirm please? Do something to confirm to me. Maybe you could even move this little toy that's here or maybe the knife even. Or maybe open a door, move something within the location. I know you're here, spirit. I can hear movement in the back room in the other end of the property. I think we're going to have a quick look. Bear with me. Can you see that MF meter? That's really going. I've actually got my phone on airplane mode, so there should be no signal to it which is a bit odd. Let's just take you for a walk to the rear of the property. This area obviously is where the poor old fella met his last. Apparently he was laid naked on the floor there. And we've certainly had visitors here since our last come. There's a bit more rubbish there and a lot of cigarettes. So there's someone been here, probably druggies or something. 
Well, as you can see with the light up there, I've got the static camera in the bedroom with a EMF meter, a cat ball, and the spirit box. There's two cat balls just on the lip of them stairs, which I'm really hoping something pushes off. So it's not a huge property. Get out, that says. But it's certainly apparently supposed to have activity. Remember last time? Oh, I don't know what that said. I've left my phone in the kitchen, but because it's Bluetooth connected, I've got the speaker on my belt. I'm not going to spend hours here, I've just, um, it's actually around about 11.30 in the evening. I usually come out about one o'clock-ish, I guess, but I couldn't sleep this evening, so I thought I'd come out, do a video for you, and as this is only maybe 28 miles from home, it's a bit more local this week. And I actually don't feel too bad, considering I've been up nearly 24 hours. But I've got to make you a video. I can't leave you without. And obviously, this is my hobby and I enjoy it, so it's good for me as well. Okay, thank you, Spirit. What did you just say to me then? Let's come back and check the phone. And then we'll have a quick check the other rooms. What did we have there? Whisper. Oh, yes, please, Spirit. If you can whisper, I'd really appreciate that. Lucky enough, we're isolated enough so I can get my torches near the window, which doesn't cause too much of a problem. just said black what do you mean by black spirit please let's have a look out here I don't think we actually went out here on the last visit this obviously is the utility area and they had a downstairs shower which I never noticed this little room behind here oh it's the toilet Okay, Spirit, come on, come and give me more, please. The last word you said was black. What do you mean by black? If I come in here, could the old gentleman maybe come forward? Could you approach me? Give me some sign of your presence, please. Come and give me something. Anything. Oh, God. Let me go and get my phone. I'll keep doing this to myself. It'd be okay if I didn't have such a heavy voice. Okay. Flaunted. What do you mean by flaunted spirit? That's a bit of a strange word. Come and show yourself. You died here in this spot. 
Did they take some time to find your body, maybe? Or was you discovered quite quickly? Please give me something if you would. Come on spirit, come and give me something. Come and move something. Let's, see, let's go upstairs and see if we can get That just said follow him. Who do you need me to follow spirit please? Let's see if we've got anything on this spirit box up here. Oh, the MF meter's gone over. And look at that flash. There's something in here. I don't know if this can give me what's come up. Let me have a look. No. I'm just seeing if, I, if it's got a log. Uh, no. That's unfortunate. Hopefully the camera's picked it up. They just said here. Can you see that EMF meter? Let's just turn it. I mean, that's seriously moving. It's just eased up. Come on, spirit, don't step away now. You were going off. Are you here with me? Don't hide. This wasn't open last time. Spirit, come and show yourself to me, please. Come and move that cat ball. I'm sure you can do something for me. One bad spirit. I've just made a few changes to the equipment. I've put the static camera in the living room and a couple of cat balls um, down on the floor where the poor old gentleman lost his life. So if cat balls begin to move in there, obviously the static camera will pick that up. It's actually got a boom mic on it, so if it can hear it. <laughs> Julia. Is that the second individual that's here? You mentioned a couple. I can see the EMF meter going off in the tiles. As I said, the phone's on airplane mode, so there's no signal going to either of these. Thank you, Spirit. I really appreciate that. Could you possibly move one of the cat balls within this property then now? These little items here are called cat balls. When you move them, they light up. That's multiple spirits. So do we have multiple spirits here now, do we? Wait for them to go off. As I was saying, spirit, I have two of these devices here. We have two in the living room on the floor and two at the top of the staircase. So I'd appreciate <laughs> Horrible? What's horrible, spirit? Are you saying that I'm horrible, maybe? I certainly don't believe so. The EMF meter is going off. I can see it. Hoping the static camera's got them in shot. I think it has. Thank you, Spirit. So clearly you are here and communicating to a fashion. Could you maybe speak into one of the cameras around this house? Each of them have a microphone. So they can each see you and hear you. And that's really what I'm here for, to communicate. So please, give me more. Give me more, please. This device here will allow me to talk to you. 
That EMF meter, I keep, I keep seeing the core of my eye going off. Please keep communicating, Spirit. I don't know what one it is, but I can see it lighting up in the tiles. May I give you my name once more, please? It's Michael. Could you maybe come and sit in the chair opposite me? Come and move the chair, slide it. <laughs> Bell hops. It's a funny old word, bell hops. Well, bell hops not people in hotels. Spirit, I can see one of these meters going off. So it's telling me that you're here. There's something here with high energy. I'd appreciate if you could take some energy from one of these devices. There's multiple devices here. There's many lights. You'll be able to take any energy from, well, anything really. As long as it's not from me. I'm not fully recharged yet. Come and do something, come and move something. I'm hoping them cat balls have been going off. Obviously you'll see that. I'll have a little image up on the screen here of the what that camera's seeing. Come on, keep communicating. And apparently you were murdered for a safe. Or the <coughs> Breathe. I'm breathing, spirit. Or are you telling me that I'll hear breathing, maybe? That'd be good. That'd be creepy. Spirit, are you draining this light? This light's on one bar, fully charged. That should last at least an hour and a half. We've been running now for about 30 minutes and that light's about to go, which is very odd. This was the light up in the bedroom. So clearly there must have been some energy usage up there. I haven't looked at the static camera actually to see what power that's got left. Spirit, did you drain this light? I can see it's about to die. Do something, please. I think the EMF meter's gone quiet, I believe. I don't think I've seen them flash in that tile. So I think whatever it was, it stepped away again. It's, it's, much, it's much like many locations. Things tend to come in waves. They don't tend to stick around. They, they, they come forward and then back off again. Maybe it is all got to do with energy. can ask as well please it's um it's not a big thing to do in the video if you would if you kindly leave a like yeah that's <laughs> agreeing with me leave a like and the only reason i say that is because the only way the video really gets out if there's more likes and it tends to push further on youtube maybe it's the algorithm but i'd appreciate a like if you wouldn't mind it doesn't take two minutes and also please turn the notification bell on so when i drop my videos obviously you'll be notified straight away. Enough of that, sorry about that. Please spirit, keep communicating with me if you would. I'm not gonna be here for long. This was just a quick visit, just to see if I can communicate with you. <laughs> Julie, we've had Julie. No, we didn't, we had Julia before. We've now got Julie. It's an awful lot of names, Spirit. And you told me that there's two people here. That's certainly more names than two people. Maybe the names are your family. Maybe you have children and this is their names. Could you confirm?
Okay, I think I'm going to go and stop that camera at the bottom of the stairs. Oh, they're talking away now. Not sure what they're saying. Let me have a look. Bear with me. Let me just turn this off. Shut this down. Oh, okay. So while I was wandering around out there, we had Don't Wait, and the last thing we've just had through was a spiritual experience. I certainly hope for a spiritual experience. <coughs> Die? Well, that's a bit nasty, spirit. Why do you want me to die? I don't think I'm going to uh, do that today, if that's okay. And may I just say, you can sod off. You're not going to kill me. Have we got a nasty spirit coming forward, have we? Is there something nasty here with me? <laughs> easiest. What do you mean by easiest spirit, please? Okay, I'm just going to leave that going. I'm just going to pack some of this equipment away and we'll just leave that running with the spirit box. So bear with me. Okay, so thank you for joining me again this week. As I said, this was only a quick explore. just wanted to really visit the location on my own and see if it is got activity here. Closing scene two. Did you see that then? The door opened. Cool, yeah, I felt that presence come in actually. I don't know if you see that, but that door just opened. Spirit, are you here with me? I really appreciate what you did there. There's no wind or anything because there's no windows open or anything else. So it certainly wasn't any breeze that did that. Something opened that door because I shut that door. Thank you, I really appreciate that. 40. That was a bit freaky. I was just about to do a closing scene then and the door come open. Maybe they're encouraging me to leave by opening the door. Spirit, I'm not going to leave by that door. I'm leaving by the front door, thank you. Okay, let's try that again. That was a bit freaky. Okay, so thank you for joining me for this explore. Uh, as I said, I just really want to revisit this murder house on my own, just to get a feel for the place and just to see if the poor old gentleman that was murdered still resides here. I think he does, although he's keeping back a little. That door certainly freaked me out a minute ago. It just opened on me as I was doing a closing scene. So I had to check it out and restart the closing. But anyway, um, John actually, as I mentioned in the start of the video, John returns, it'll be today now. It's actually Shadow, yes, please do. John's actually returning today. He's got a long drive, but he'll be home later today. But in any case, look out in the next few weeks or so. Myself and John have got some really good places that we're going to be investigating over the coming weeks so as i said earlier if you'd leave a like i'd really appreciate that and obviously turn the notification bell on and it'll let you know when we drop our next video so until next week you take care of yourselves god bless bye bye now